What's up guys? Welcome to another episode. Welcome back to another episode of the Southampton career mode. And in the last episode, I don't really remember what happened. It was a while ago. We drew 1-1 one, one, one at Swansea and lost 2-0 at home to Manchester United. We beat West Brom. I think that was what happened in the last episode. And we are sitting pretty in 12th place. 7 games played. 8 points. Not good enough. We know better. We got Chelsea though. Last year's league champions coming. We're going to Stamford Bridge and we've got to hit them with that formation. Cheese. There's the Southampton fans. We're taking on. We're going to Stamford Bridge. This will be a really, really big test for us to see if we can play, hang with the best. Eden Hazard. Uh, Oscar, William, Diego Costa, Ramirez, John O.B. Mikel, Alibaba. They've got some weird defenders. they got Terry Matic, Fabregas, Falcao, Tortois, and Aspi Lequay on the bench. That's surprising. Those are usually some first teamers right there, and they're, they're bench warming. But here is Victor Awaniyama, and here comes Awaniyama. He cuts in. He finds a wide open Warren Bertrand. He has a goal. What a save, Pegovic. Wonderful save. It lands to Gaston Ramirez, who finds Victor Wanyama. Just why? <laughs> Sorry. And I hear Mane puts it back post, and it's offside. Pegovic had that one covered, though. So. Pegovic. I know, here you go. It's a thrown in the same fifth minute. We hung with Chelsea so well. And here comes Diego Costa to absolutely end us. We really played well against Chelsea. I couldn't show you because it would have taken too much of the episode. But we played so immense against Chelsea. World-class defending. And then Cedric again. He gets exposed at the back post. I mean, oh, look at that goalkeeping. That is a blunder, EA. Fix your game. That was headed right at the goalkeeper, and he still finds a way to miss that save. But we're going to take off Pella and Shane, or and Ward Pross for Shane Long. So hopefully we can get the last winning, last minute goal, or we could get a draw here. It's Shane Long. It's Shane Long. Oh, he hits the post. Unlucky. Shane Long. Oh, could have given us a 1 1 draw. But it's a he hits the outside of the post. But here in the 70, 90th minute, it's oh what is that shot? One Yama is trying to first time hit it. He has no finishing, no shot technique at all. Victor Wanyama. But we end one 0 and that was undeserved. At least a draw from that game because we really played well. I w I really wish I could have shown you, but we really did hang with Chelsea. We attacked them. We played well, and I hope I could show you the match stats to prove to you that I did play a solid solid match against Chelsea. Yeah, okay, if you look at that, we didn't have the possession, but we had more shots than them. We didn't have as many on target, but I'm telling you, we played well. I was very, very impressed by how we were playing, but we take a loss to the league champions after Cedric gets exposed by his high at the back and Diego Costa heads into the back of the net. So now we're going to do some trim training here after I did a couple myself. Close control, and then okay, Matt Target. He's getting close to that 69 overall rating, which will be absolutely beast. He is a he's immense. He is very immense. Now here's Target. Oh no, we're gonna get a scouting update. Yes, am I gonna have a go at it? No, we're going back to training, and here we're taking penalties with Victor Waniyama, and he's burying them. He's got to get better at finishing, so why not get him from the penalty spot? It's also going to improve his penalties. Oh, look at that finish. Side netting. Top corner. No chance for a goalkeeper. And I'm actually bearing the penalties here. I'm doing pretty well with Victor Waniyama. And he's going to go, oh, look at that. That's a pen and a half into the side netting. And we didn't do that well this week, but no one upgraded, so that's okay. But we've got Leicester City now. At home at the St. Mary Stadium. After we look at some potential scouts, Kyle Linnall, 4'10. I would get him, but he's he's 4'10. 5'3. Matthew Pope. He's too small. He's gonna get bullied in this game. 
if you're tiny, you're gonna get bullied in this game. I'm just, it's just honestly. But now here we go. We've got Leicester City. I hope you like that transition, though. And we're at the St. Mary Stadium, taking on Jamie, the likes of Jamie Vardy and Leicester City. To me, this is probably in real life. They're one of the hardest teams to play because you just never know. Some weeks they just show up, and Jamie Vardy, Yuzhu, uh, Yuzhu hasn't played that much, but this year, Ma this year, but Mares, Drinkwater, all of them—they've got a strong attack force, and they will kill you on the counter attacks. You see, Leicester's in eighth, we're in twelfth. So if we could get the three points, that would be massive. Our lineup is switched up a little bit. We're going with the four, the four. We're going with two up top: Mane and Longs, Davis, Tadic, and. Who's the other guy? I totally forgot, but we have in the midfield, and look at they've got Castro Spike on goal. Vardy, Kramrich, Inler, Danger, Men. They've got Yeshua on the bench, Drinkwater on the bench. I don't see that man. Mares, Ria Mares. He's not even on the team, but oh well. It's too bad for them. In the seventh minute here. Shane Long, he's gonna get that one. Come on, Shane. He does. He keeps it. He keeps it in. Oh, he's trying to take defenders, but he fails so, so hard. But we're going to put on the forward pressure. And what a tackle by J. Rodriguez. He feeds it in to Sadio Mane. 1-0 to the Saints. That is world-class footballing from the Saints. South, they have to lead 1-0. Thanks to a wonderful fist pass from J. Rodriguez. After that wonderful slide tackle, he finds Sadio Mane, who buries it into the back of the net. One touch, bang. His second of the season. And that's a great way to get... 10 minutes in, get the lead at home, get the crowd on our side, get them into this game, get them screaming. Let's try to take Leicester out of this game. Now they're going with the free kick. I knew it was coming, but I couldn't stop it, and it just goes over the bar. Inler, I think he used to play for Inter Milan. He almost buried, he almost got that chance, and there's Shinji Gozaki. Oh, he almost find Vardy, but it was a little bit too far ahead of him for him to catch up with that, but that was a peach of a ball. Next game, next episode, we've got Liverpool, and I'm having a really hard time getting this game off of being able to edit this game on my laptop, so I'm gonna have to figure out a way to get it, because it's only showing green screen on the preview screen, so I've gotta find on a way, I've gotta find a way. But Mane, man of the match so far, he got that goal, and I didn't show you the clips, but he was just shredding Leicester's defense. He's got the dribbling and the pace, and that's enough for me. Oh, what another steal. J. Rodriguez is all over the place today. He whips the ball in. Back post, Shane Low. 2-0. 51 minutes in. The Saints are 2-0 up. What a ball. J. Rodriguez, have a day. Have a day, son. Two steals, and then he fizzes it into someone or crosses it into someone who buries that chance. It's 2-0. J. Rodriguez. He is a he's on fire in this three in this formation with three with two forwards. So if I ever play this again, I know to play J. Rodriguez on the left because he's an absolute boost. He is basing and yeah, facing. Man, J. Rodriguez, what a ball and chain long. Don't take any credit away from your first goal of the season as that super sub, but you are getting the start today over Grazio Napoli, who hasn't been burying the goals or banging in the goals. Now here, oh, what a foul. That's a terrible foul by Wanayama, and he's given Lester a world-class spot to take this free crook, and it's Kamrich. Oh, he goes over it. Fuchs right to Inler again. Good save, Forrester. It's right to Forrester. Not the best of a free kick. Here's Wanayama. Oh, what a save. What a save. Casper Spike on fire. And here's Okazaki again. Oh my god, I thought that went in. Whew. Just a bunch of highlights right there. I had to show you, it was really good. But here's trying to get Tadic's first goal of the season. He's pacing, he's going. Dusan Tadic, he cuts in. Tadic, oh, it's 3 0. That's game. Southampton get the three points. A 3 0 win. Most convincing one of the season. And that is Dusan Tadic. What a finish. Doesn't need teammates. Left set defender for dead. He is out of the pitch, and then he's. I didn't actually press finesse. I smashed it, and he finessed it into the back of the net. 3 0. We take down Leicester City. Gets in. That is world, 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 world class. I'm so, so happy with the boys after that performance. And now we've got Liverpool in the next episode. I have to find a way to edit this video for you guys. I will find a way. If I don't, I just have to show you what happened and not use this anymore to record. But, oh well. But until then, hope you guys had a wonderful day. Tadish Long and Mane did the business for the Saints. And Southampton walk out of here with three, no, with three points and a 3-0 no win. 
It's a really good play. That formation worked really well for me against Leicester City. And that, because they were playing with two people as well. So that really worked out for us. Waniyama sitting deep. Davis in front of him. Tadic on the right. Rodriguez on the left. Rodriguez had a wonderful day. Two assists. He was a peach of a, of a winger. And out here doing some more training. But until then, have a great day, guys. Don't forget to like this video. You guys have been showing massive support on Lakers My Jam and Southampton Kareemwood. I really appreciate it. Have a wonderful day. Gamer Station, saw subscribe. Don't forget to like. And peace.